Dear students, let me present to you moment ratios. Moment ratios beta 1 and beta 2. Beta 1 is connected with the concept of skewness. Beta 2 is connected with the concept of kurtosis. Hum log Pakistan mein aam taur pe kurtosis bhi kehte hain aur kurtosis bhi iski ek pronunciation hai. All right, let's begin with the uh, concept of skewness. Aap usko achhi tarah se jaante hi hain ke agar right tail jo hai distribution ki that is longer than the left tail, we say that the distribution is positively skewed. Agar left tail uh, lambi hai, right tail se, then we will say that it is negatively skewed. Aur agar wo balanced hai, to phir hum kahenge ke it is symmetric. It is not skewed. So, ab isko measure karne ke liye, hum kaise chalenge? Let me put, uh, present it to you in a formal manner. Let x be a random variable with mean mu and variance sigma square, uh, which obviously means that the standard deviation is sigma, such that the third moment about mu exists, third moment exists karaho, then the value of the ratio mu3 over sigma cubed, mu3 over sigma cubed, this uh, ratio is often used as a measure of skewness. Now, is pe zara focus karein ke ye hum baat kya kar rahe hain? Hum ye keh rahe hain ke jo third central moment hai, usko agar standard deviation ki third power se divide kiya jaye, to ye jo ratio hai, this can be used as a measure of skewness. Aur ye kis tara uh, humare kaam aayega skewness ko measure karne ke silsile mein, uske liye, Aap dekhen ke aap ke saamne aap jo hints hain, ke this ratio will be negative if the distribution is negatively skewed. This ratio will be uh, equal to zero if the distribution is not skewed, yani if it is symmetric. And this ratio will be positive if the distribution is positively skewed. Uh, so it's a very simple way of assessing. Aap kisi bhi variable ke liye ye ratio uh, nikaal lehen. Aur agar wo negative hai, aapka answer, to aap samaj jayen ke wo distribution negatively skewed hai, and so on. Ab isi ratio ka agar hum square kar lehen, yani numerator ka bhi square ho jayega zahir hai phir, aur denominator ka bhi, to ab jo cheez aayegi, students, that is denoted by beta 1, and that may be called the first moment ratio. And that also acts as a measure of skewness. Uh, so let's look at it carefully. Jo pehle mene aapke saamne rakha tha, wo kya tha? Mu3 over sigma cubed. Ab hum usko square karne lege hai. So now what do we have? Mu3 square over sigma cubed square. Now, this sigma cube square hai na, aap isko zahir hai ke wo aapko pata hai ke power multiply ho jati hai aapis mein. So, sigma cube square ka matlab hai sigma raised to 6 because 3 twos are 6. Lekin phir usi ko aap is tarah bhi to lik sakte hai na, ke sigma square cube because obviously sigma square ko agar cube karenge to phir bhi wohi do number multiply ho rahe hai. 2 multiplied by 3 is 6 and it is still sigma raised to 6. So, now when we have written this way, so what do we have found? In the upper numerator, it is going on, mu3 square. And we have said now that sigma square cube. But sigma square, the variance, that is the same thing as the second moment about the mean, the second central moment. So, if we put that there, then what does it make the shape of it? mu3 square over mu2 cube. Ye jo hai expression, isko beta1 se denote kiya jata hai. 
and this is called the first moment ratio. This is also a measure of skewness. Please, ek baat magar aap na bhuliyega, ab chunke square ho gaya na, isliye this quantity can never be negative. Abhi thodi der pehle jab tak square nahi kiya hua tha, wahan maine aapse kaha tha ki wo cheez agar negative answer aaye to it means the distribution is negatively skewed, positive answer aaye to it means it is positively skewed, vagaira. Yahan, chunke square ho gaya hai, to isliye ab negative to ho hi nahi sakta. तो यहाँ पे फिर हमें क्या इससे क्या मिलेगा या क्या पता चलेगा इन अ सिंपल वे आप इतनी सी बात तो बहुत जल्दी से समझ ही लेंगे कि इफ दिस एंटिटी इज इक्वल टू जीरो दैट मींस दैट द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन इज नॉट स्क्यूड देर इज नो स्क्यूनेस देर इज जीरो स्क्यूनेस सो इट इज एब्सोल्युटली सिमेट्रिक लेकिन अगर ये इसका आंसर जीरो की बजाय कोई भी पॉजिटिव आंसर आया तो दैट मीन्स दैट द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन इज स्क्यूड हाँ लेकिन हम उसकी डायरेक्शन का अंदाज़ा इस एक्सप्रेशन से नहीं लगा सकते कि वो नेगेटिवली स्क्यूड है कि पॉजिटिवली स्क्यूड है मगर इतना पता लग जाता है कि इट इज स्क्यूड इसके बाद लेट अस फोकस ऑन द अदर कॉन्सेप्ट द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ कर्टिस आप जानते ही हैं कि दिस दिस इज द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ द द अमाउंट ऑफ peakedness of the distribution is it too much peaked or is it like the normal distribution or is it even flatter than the normal distribution to iske liye jo moment ratio liya jata hai that is beta 2 aur beta 2 jo hai uski uh, uska formula kya hai beta 2 is given by mu 4 over sigma raised to 4 fourth moment about the mean divided by the fourth power of the standard deviation to isko zahir hai ki hum is tarah bhi likh sakte hain ki mu 4 over sigma square whole square aur phir sigma square kyunki variance hota hai aur variance yani hota hai wo lekin wo second central moment bhi to hota hi hai na mu 2 isliye ab hum is expression ko इस तरह भी लिख सकते हैं म्यू फोर ओवर म्यू टू स्क्वायर और इसी तरह आमतौर पे लिखा जाता है और इसको कहते हैं सेकेंड मोमेंट रेशो कह सकते हैं और इसके लिए जो नोटेशन है जैसे मैंने कहा इट इज बीटा टू सो बीटा टू इज इक्वल टू म्यू फोर ओवर म्यू टू स्क्वायर बीटा वन जो थोड़ी देर पहले लिया था वो क्या था म्यू थ्री स्क्वेर ओवर म्यू टू क्यूब और ये वाला म्यू फोर ओवर म्यू टू स्क्वेर इसकी इंटरप्रिटेशन क्या है यानी वो जो पीकनेस का फिनमिन है इससे कैसे अखज करेंगे स्टूडेंट्स दिस एक्सप्रेशन इफ इट कम्स आउट टू बी ग्रेटर दैन थ्री देन वी हैव वी कंक्लूड दैट द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन इज लेप्टोकैटिक और आप जानते ही हैं कि लेप्टोकैटिक का मतलब है मोर पीक्ड मोर पीक्ड दैन द नॉर्मल डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन इफ दिस रेशो कम्स आउट टू बी इक्वल टू थ्री देन वी कंक्लूड दैट द डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन इज मीजोकैटिक यानी एज मच पीक्ड एज द नॉर्मल डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन दैट ब्यूटिफुल बेल शेप्ड कर्व एंड इफ दिस ratio is less than 3 then we conclude that the distribution is platycurtic even flatter than the normal distribution so this is the story of moment ratios